match for the purists today, Lofters? Oh, I enjoy those sorts of games. I think that's um, they're the sort of performances probably that if we'd have won five 0 and played total football, I'd probably enjoyed it less than that. To be honest, it was um, resolute defending, won every first header in the box, um, kept the ball well at times when we needed to, looked to threat on the counter, um, and once we get one nil in front, we're always confident. I think this year we've only dropped four points from winning positions. So, you know, that's, which is phenomenal for, for this level of football and another clean sheet, 13 and 21, you know, brilliant. And to be fair, there's probably two big chances in the game. I mean, I think it's fair to say that once we got 1-0, we, we, we capped in a little bit, um, as we do. Um, and Brown has made an unbelievable save with three, four minutes to go. I don't think there's any other goalkeeper in the in the division, maybe other than our, our sub-keeper in Aaron. I think he's, you know, top drawer and sits there and is patient. But other than those two, I don't think there's anyone else saving that. Um, big, strong, great hands, clawed it well, and they were up, already up the touchline, assuming it was a goal, and Shaquille done everything right, it was just a brilliant save. And, you know, we've we've stuck our big chance, Ben Bayman, five and five, in the back of the net. And if he carries on going the way he's going for us, he'll have, he'll have 20, and no doubt if he, if he was with us at the start of the season, he'd be competing for the golden boot, because he's a proper, proper number nine, and that's probably, you know, it's one of the points today, those two, and then two big signings for us during the season, and along with Matt Hurley and Asa, have, have really added to what was already a really, really good football team. So, yeah, you asked it was for the purists. I've gone off on a tangent, um, but yeah, great win. Delighted with the three points. They're a really good side. Um, I said to them after, I wish they played that well um, when they played the other top team down here because I watched them that day and they, they didn't play as well. And they thought they were tremendous today. They're a really good side and they're uh, they caused lots of teams problems and they're doing a really good job. Yeah, well, one to fifteen, we did a really sound job. I mean, Bailey came on for his only on the pitch for five ten minutes, yeah. but he, he got us up the pitch. Eldor Gold on the ball did a really good job. That was nice to see. Well, I, I think I think you're right, and you look at Nick. I mean, Joe Hillard and Asa have come on the first two subs. They've got a lot of starts and a lot of football. Nick and Bailey have had to be really, really patient, and they, they've they been phenomenal for us. And, and it goes, it's easy to say that when you make your substitutes, but Nick's, Nick's one of five, six throw-ins and drove up the pitch from us. Bailey's won, you know, four or five throw-ins in the corner in the last couple of minutes and had some really nice touches. And those players are every bit of important to us as, as the players I was talking about a minute ago. And it is, it's a squad effort. I mean, you look at Josh Bennett, Charlie Dashfield and David Guru who haven't kicked a ball for us today, uh, and the 15 that uh, have done ever so well. You know, we've, we've got strength everywhere. We look a proper team at the moment, um, and long way to continue, really. But long, long way to go. 2022 is ended. We've kept <coughs> 29 clean sheets in 2022. Um, if we can keep half as many as that next year, um, we'll, we'll be doing all right. So, yeah, that's good. And on to New Year again, uh, Monday, Pegasus. Yeah. Yeah, we've obviously got, we'll be in training Thursday um, and then we've got the Bank Holiday Monday fixture. Um, again, on the 3G, we've got them all in sort of quick succession. Um, we're back up at Roman Glass in the League Cup. We've got to go to Melbourne then on the 21st of January. Um, so that, that helps, it helps getting a bit of continuity of playing on, on that particular surface. Um, be a really tough game Monday. You know, them and Raiders have been brilliant additions to the, to the league. Both really good sides. Um, so it'll be real tough. And we, we probably had, had them at the right time for us. Their manager was said it was the worst performance he's had when we beat them six at our place at the start of the season. Um, we were very good on the day. They had, a, they had an off day. We know how tough it's going to be. You know, the cup final that we had against them um, at the back end of May where we just won 1 0. Really good side. They've got Carlos Moreira as a brilliant player. Price, the captain, middle of the park. The left winger, great player. They've got Greaves back there. You know, you've got, got some really, really good players in their team and it'll be another exactly the same as today really enough another tough, tough test and if we can play off you know we'll get, we'll get three points again and play as well as we have done today it'll be a really good Christmas period for us but one of the two done not getting carried away as I say every single time it's one game at a time but it, it, it feels a good in today it feels, feels nice to get the three points so yeah happy happy with that excellent uh, Merry Christmas and uh, Happy New Year yeah Happy New Year thank you very yeah. much cheers cheers mate